This video is part four of the unit three chess review, and we're going to be sketching graphs of linear equations. So here I have uh, two, uh, two equations. This one says y equals 2x plus 3, and we are going to graph it. Again, this is in what's called uh, slope-intercept form, or uh, y equals mx plus b. So when it is slope-intercept form, the a number right here, plus 3, is our y-intercept. That means when x is 0, what is, uh, when x is 0, the y is 3. Or all you have to do is remember that we simply uh, take that plus 3 and we go from 0. Since it's a positive 3, we go up 1, 2, 3 on the y-axis and put a point right there. So I'm going to start with that point right there, 3. Now... I need to know the slope. Well, the slope is the number, uh, the coefficient with x, it's 2. We can think of that as a fraction, as 2 over 1. Well, that means from a given point, which we now know uh, the y-intercept is 3, from there we would go a slope of 2, so rise over run, a rise of 2, and a run of 1, and we would put the next point right there. Okay, so let me go ahead and do that. We put the next point right there. Again, it's a, rise, it's a slope of 2, which is 2 over 1, rise over run, so 1, 2, and over 1, and that's our equation, and we can draw a line through that. And that would be uh, our sketch. Okay, all right, now let's take a look at this one here, y equals negative 5 fourths x plus 2. This one has a y-intercept of plus 2. So we can start uh, with the y-intercept of 2. So I'm going to go to the... Uh, I'm going to go to 0. And since it's a positive 2, I'm going to go up 2 again. And I will put my point at 0, 2. That's the y-intercept. And then the coefficient in front of x is a fraction of negative 5 fourths. Notice because it's negative, I know that my slope should be going downhill from left to right. The top number is the rise, the bottom number is the run. So I'm just going to put that negative with the 5. So from this point, I'm going to go negative 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 units. And then from here, I'm going to go over 4 units to the right. I put the negative with the 5, so that makes the 4 positive. So after I go negative 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, I'm going to go over 1, 2, 3, 4, and I'll put my point there, my next point there. And then I can sketch my graph through those points right there. I didn't do that one very well, but you get the idea. All right, and there is my negative graph, okay? All right, so that, again, was a quick review of sketching a, uh, a graph from a line or from a linear equation.